All right, welcome back. So we're going to do one from outside here today. Going to be over by the fire. And uh, going to review this uh, Disruptor cigar. And I figured expensive not to do a review when I smoke it. Uh, the um, cigar shop I go to got these in. It said limited edition. Didn't tell me the camera wouldn't focus on them, but uh, there it is. It's the uh, Disruptor, the uh, Freud Cigar Company, the Sigmund. Beautiful looking wrapper. Crazy price tag, $42. Let's take a big cigar, 7.5 by, I believe, 48. We'll check here, but... Uh, Gonna smoke it before we do. We'll do the obligatory boot check and watch check. Um, so the boots, just pick these up. Uh, they're a little tight, so I'll probably be putting them on the market. These are some um, aged Lucases that uh, have worn very well. Beautiful alligator belly, um, kind of almost like a sea turtle. I don't know if it's sea turtle or alligator, but great boot. Uh, basically looks brand new. Uh, about 40 50 year old boot uh, here is the uh, Omega Seamaster uh, beautiful looking watch uh, nice blue so let's uh, put the camera down we'll fire up the uh, this Freud and get the camera set up so here we go with the disruptor seven and a half by 50 we'll get this uh, We'll take a look at it outside of the wrapper. It's got a unique uh, long paper, the Freud on it. You can see it's really a nice, nice color, nice shade. Uh, at least in the article I was reading, it's undisclosed. Sorry right, about the focus. As to the content of it, all all we know is that it's a Dominican. But uh, let's take a look. We'll see. We'll see what we can find out. There's some information here online that I can pull. But um, yeah, I, I think. I mean, when you're at the forty-two dollar range, when you are like well above, you're above Davidoff, you're above Padron. Um, you know, it's a real limited market, so it better be a damn good cigar. This is the Disruptor Sigmund Chapter 1. So after the uh, great, great uh, smell to it, <coughs> deep sense of uh, fresh tobacco. I don't know how much it's been aged. It says 2023 on there. Um, the pre-light draw is a little tough. I'm not getting uh, a real clear draw, but we'll see. And make sure we get it well torched here. We want to give it a fair fair review, make sure we light it well. And this one ought to do it. So three puffs and we ought to be good to go. One, two, three, pretty much. A little bit of a tight draw. You know, it's a big cigar, seven and a half. It says by 50. It doesn't look like 50 to me, but that's what it says. Um, let's draw smaller. Hmm. Beautiful night. Um, right away.
you get some uh, unique flavors to it. See if I can wash it down with my tea. Hard to identify the flavor. Unique, I like it. It's uh, a good flavor, not not harsh at all. Got some strength to it. Um, I gotta say, the draw is not great. Um, you know, I've smoked those. So this is a, a double. Corona, right? And I, I've smoked that Davidoff Colorado Claro, uh, the double R, and there's no issues with the draw on that side. It's about the same same size of a cigar. With this one, you can see with the limited amount of smoke that I'm getting, it's uh, it's having it's having some trouble drawing. Now, maybe it needs aged. At this price point, it shouldn't. I mean, you're paying top, top dollar. It ought to be well aged when it comes to you. Now, I got it. Um, I should have checked the humidity level of it. It seems fine in terms of, uh, you know, it doesn't seem dried out or anything or overly moist per se but I got it from the uh, cigar shop uh, on Wednesday you know this is Monday so it spent several days in my humidor so it could be fine the draw is annoying um, you know, I mean, you, you just don't want to smoke a cigar that you have to fight to, to draw it. Hi, Wadi. Stay away from my computer. So, let's see what they say about it here. So, this is... play with the toy right now. This is from Half Wheel. You see, I'm just going to wrap or bind your filler. Now, maybe it is now. By now, I don't know. Release date, May of 2023. This is now September 2023. Um, and the wrapper is tasty. No, Waddy. So, yeah, here it even says scars roll very firm, even hard density, a little give. Um, yeah, I, I agree with that. Um, a bit of creaminess that it talks about. I mean, I'm getting some of that, but, yeah, it's just hard to get beyond the draw. Waddy, no. Of all the toys, you got to pick the one that squeaks. Uh, flavor medium, medium plus, according to Half Wheel. I agree with that. It's not overly uh, powerful. It does have good flavor. Um, I'm interested to see how it how it goes. As you know, I get deeper into the cigar, hopefully the draw is better. <laughs> yeah, so I agree with Half Wheel here. It says it's uh, varying levels of frustration when it comes to the cigar's combustion. Almost actively refusing to burn, puff or two, then going out. Um, yeah, so I don't know, but 
yeah, you can't you can't have a forty five dollar cigar that doesn't draw well. Bottom line, so um, it kind of says here the same thing. Uh, bad first impression. You know, it. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I agree. I mean, it, it's you got to do better. Got to do better. Um, I had one of the other uh, Freud cigars, and I I thought it was okay. Again, it was a twenty-eight dollar cigar, and I wouldn't say it was thing with retrievers you can throw it but they'll be back uh, you know I I want to like it but yeah I had the uh, alter ego $28 alter ego and it, it was it was okay um, maybe a B, you know, on a, I, I wouldn't even say a B plus. I mean, it was, it was a B. It was a good, decent cigar. Not real big for 28 bucks, that's for sure. Um, this cigar, I want to like it. I, you know, the flavor seems to be there. It's interesting. But the draw is going to have to get better. Or, uh, or it's going to be a, a bust. A big bust, a forty-two dollar bust. So, all right. Well, as far as I'm going to get, the draw is getting slightly better, where you can pick up the flavor. But um, I definitely would not pick one up. Not yet, anyway. Give it a year. Let it sit on the shelf. Maybe it'll be better. Waddy's having a lot more fun with his toy than I am with this cigar, so. Alright. Hope you found the review useful. Be safe. Still got a fire. Beautiful night in Ohio. And, uh, we'll see you again soon.